हाय कैसे आप सब वेलकम बैक टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल सैसवेद विकास एंड इन द लास्ट लेसन वी हैड डिस्कस द स्टेटमेंट एंड वाइल द लास्ट ऑफ दैट लाइक वी आर डूइंग दिस टाइटल एंड फोर्ट नोट ना सो देर वेर मिस्टेक सम फ्रॉम माय साइड दैट that we are using this title and footnote at the combined then we can use this data set then once you run this data set then you will see that the complete title and footnote in that project report so you can't use this footnote after the data set you have to mention that global statement at the top of that particular data set then you can use that data set so just for the revision just you can change that thing and in the today session we are going to use the small topic very small topic that is the options so what are the option uh, that uh, we can use that one like uh, uh, still we are uh, we use that thing but we can uh, uh, we can use that for saving our time like that will remove that will uh, that will process timing that will reduce the process time while the back side of the screen what is the happening in that like uh, we already discussed in the last session the keep statement so we were doing it like this way the data step and create is uh, calling this data set and using this keep statement while then running so there is something changes in the that statement that while the using this option like we can use this as an option in the same statement in the same calling while the calling data set we can use this option as a statement like we want that so what are the changes here you need to know that once you are once you are doing this with the skip statement as a statement and once you are doing with the as, as an option so what is the changes the first important point is it saves your time like uh, while the running program it saves your time first uh, what happened at the here like it will read the first class data set then it read the keep statement and then uh, you will get the filter result but at using this as a funds option what will happen the same time it read the class data set then at the same time it read the keep statement and give the filter result at the same time that is the important this is the very small program so here it not any necessary like by using this option or a statement but once you are running the project once you are doing in the project that with the report thing so there will be like a huge data set there is huge data program coding program so at that time you will see that while using this as an statement and while using this as an option it saves our times it will remove it will reduce the process time and this is also uh, just because we due to the pdv we'll see in the upcoming video why this is happen and what are the basic thing what are the in back side of the screen back side of the running the program that execution we will see in the pdv lecture like what is the thing happening as per now just know that what is the option how we are dealing with that option so option are the thing like we are using that uh, uh, function we are using with the function that makes our work easier that makes our work process easier that reduces the time it works faster as compared to the using as a statement so uh let's uh, understand this thing while using this like once we are doing this one in the last lecture like we using this statement we can run this program we are getting the same result we are getting the result as name only variable because i want to keep the only name similarly if you are using this as an option then you will also get the same result because the program will be same the main focus is will be on the low log window when you run that program the process time the real time that you will be different as compared to this so that is very very important in this one like once you run this one program the time will be more as compared to the, this option similarly for the drop one as we are using the last lecture the drop statement will takes time while reading the program from the class data set then again using that drop statement the, to filter the program to filter the data then it will show the output result but while using this drop as an option it will read the class data set same time it will drop the option like whatever the variable you want to drop at the same time it will drop and give the filter result directly that is the important of the option and also we have option like a first option and ops we can use with the proc print procedure step 
what is this thing like uh, suppose without we are using without using that proc print we are not getting any like uh, we are uh, let's understand this with the example like suppose we are using this with the without any option so what will happen like once you run this data set once you run this procedure x step then what will happen you are getting the result in the printed board but you are not interested for the full data set you are not interested for the full observation you are only interested for some observation just want to uh, analyze the first five observation only then at the time you can use this option first ops is equal to from one to from one first observation to fifth observation so what it will do it will give you the result in the top five from the whole data set so you can see here uh, while running this program while running this procedure step with the option first ops is equal to ops and i'm giving this ops is equal to from first to five so we are getting the result in that way but if you are not interested for the any uh, first starting position then you can also give that one first ops is uh, like uh, not for, for only the first position you can start from anywhere like uh, if you are interested for that uh, from four to nine like or from four to ten then you can also get that thing that result no issue that you will get the same result but there is an, another option for the uh, for the uh, ops the observation is like ops only without first ops we can use that ops it will give the top six top five whatever the observation i will provide it will give the top that one from one to this till there so whatever the thing inside from one to this and first ops and ops we are using we need to we just give the start from where you need to go to the first and ops till where you need to go so these are about the option like you need to know how to deal with the option how to uh, use that option of uh, how uh, like uh, how the action uh, how the option is going to action with that uh, data set so this is all about the pdb we'll see in the upcoming video as of now just learn this option because this is very important also while doing the program while creating the data while doing the project like in, in the pro making the report you'll get benefit from this thing that's why you need to know these options Thank you for this. Thank you so much.